In this video, I will be taking you on a trip back in professional sports history. New England professional sports history to be more specific as I will dive into former professional sports teams that have called the New England area of the United States home. Current teams that play here in New England won't be covered as I will only be discussing teams that no longer play for a city here in New England. Strap yourself in as history class is now in session. The Pawtucket Red Sox, also known as the Paw Sox, were a professional minor league baseball team based in Pawtucket, Rhode Island. The team was a member of the International League and was the AAA affiliate of the Boston Red Sox from 1973 to 2020. They played their home games at McCoy Stadium in Pawtucket, Rhode Island as the only professional baseball team in the state of Rhode Island. Its most recent championship win was in 2014. Following the 2020 season, the team moved to Worcester, Massachusetts to become the Worcester Red Sox. The Pawtucket Red Sox were born as a AA Eastern League franchise in 1970. Three years later, Boston's AAA affiliate in the International League replaced the Eastern League Paw Sox. After enduring three different owners, at least two threats to move the team elsewhere in bankruptcy, the Paw Sox were purchased from the International League by local industrialist Ben Maunder in January 1977. Over the next 38 years, Maunder, who unfortunately passed away in 2010, and his heirs stabilized the franchise and turned it into a success. It was twice selected the winner of Baseball America's Bob Freitas Award as the top AAA operation in the minor league baseball in 1990 and in 2003. Won the 1990 John H. Johnson Presidents Award, which led its league in total attendance three times between 2004 and 2008 and captured three Governor's Cups as playoff champions. On February 23, 2015, the team was sold to a group headed by the then Boston Red Sox President and Chief Executive Officer Larry Lucchino and Rhode Island Attorney James J. Skeffington. Thwarted in two attempts to replace McCoy Stadium with a new facility, first in adjacent Providence, Rhode Island, then in a downtown site in Pawtucket. The club announced on August 17, 2018 that it would move to Worcester, 42 miles away, in 2021. In November 2019, the franchise announced that the team would be called the Worcester Red Sox. On June 30th, 2020, it was announced that the 2020 minor league baseball season would not be played, another impact of the COVID-19 pandemic on sports. Thus, the team last played minor league games in Pawtucket during the 2019 season. In baseball lore, the Pawtucket Red Sox are known to be part of the longest baseball game in professional history. The Paw Sox played in and won the longest game in professional baseball history, which was a 33-inning affair against the Rochester Red Wings at McCoy Stadium. The game started on April 18, 1981. Play was suspended at 4.07 in the morning at the end of the 32nd inning. The game did not resume until June 23rd when the Red Wings returned to Pawtucket. Only one inning was needed with the Paw Sox winning 3-2 in the bottom of the 33rd when first baseman Dave Koza drove in the leadoff hitter, second baseman Marty Barrett with a bases-loaded single off Cliff Speck. Neither Speck nor Steve Grilly, the Red Wings' losing pitcher, were even on the team's roster back in April. Future Major League Hall of Fame players Cal Ripken Jr. and Wade Boggs played in the game. On June 23, 2006, the Paw Sox celebrated the 25th anniversary of the longest game with events and festivities when they played the Columbus Clippers. The 35th anniversary was, was also commemorated on April 19, 2016. Several Paw Sox players and personnel have been inducted into the International League Hall of Fame. They are owner Ben Mondor, manager Joe Morgan, outfielder Jim Rice, third baseman Wade Boggs, and then team president Mike Tamburo, now their vice chairman. Several former Paw Sox players have also been inducted into the National Baseball Hall of Fame in Cooperstown, New York, including Carlton Fisk, Wade Boggs, and Jim Rice. In July 2016, Rice, Boggs, and Mondor became the inaugural class of inductees into the Paw Sox Hall of Fame. Additions are considered on an annual basis. The following are the current Pawtucket Red Sox Hall of Fame members. Ben Mondor, Jim Rice, Wade Boggs, Joe Morgan, Mo Vaughn, Carlton Fisk, Mike Tamburo, Fred Lynn, and Roger Clemens. I really hope you enjoyed this history lesson on a former New England sports team that you may or may not have known about. Truthfully, as I make these videos about these former New England teams, I'm learning a lot myself. 
please like the video if you enjoyed it and please consider subscribing if you're new to the channel or haven't considered subscribing yet. Please comment your thoughts down below as I would love to hear them. But until the next team, I will see you in the next one. But as always, I love you and I will see ya.